welcome back to my channel or if you're new here thank you so much for clicking on this video and stopping by I haven't uploaded in like two months so uh, if you've stuck around all this time thank you so much I feel like now that it's autumn I just wanted to like enjoy summer after like everyone's had pretty much the worst year and a half I just wanted to enjoy summer but now that we are back in autumn I feel like I am ready to sit down and film content um, yeah today I'm back with a huge haul we've got things from small businesses home sense next um anthropology so many different places I'll try and link everything down below or if you want to know where something's from and I haven't said just leave me a comment and yeah let's just get on into the video okay so first things first you might have seen this in a few people's videos I actually picked this up a couple of weeks ago and I've been so desperate to share this with you but I've been waiting for some of my other like orders to come through so this was from HomeSense my HomeSense is in a TK Maxx I don't know if that's the same with all of them um, but this is the Martha Stewart um, basically large pumpkin candle so it's one two three four five six it's a six wicked candle it's bloody huge smells amazing very like caramelly and just autumn autumn <laughs> autumnal and yeah I just love this and I just think this is the perfect little decoration I just think this would look so cute on like a coffee table like in the middle of a dining room table a sideboard something like that just very cute subtle Halloween autumn vibes also from home sense I picked up this mug this is so cute it's by Sheffield home and it just says coffee on the front I just think this is so pretty I love the shape of it and it can store so much in here so your morning coffee is gonna hit different in here I just thought this was a really pretty mug it's just kind of white with little black speckles and then completely black on the inside I can't remember how much I paid for this I think it was like 4 99 which is pretty good for this size mug is actually basically the same size as my head. <laughs> then also picked up some chai syrup. This is from Skinny Syrup, so it claims to be zero calories. Not really sure how that works, um, but this was $3.99. I have also recently picked up a pumpkin spice syrup. Got it on Amazon. I'll try and find the link for you. 10 out of 10, put it in a coffee, put it in your hot chocolate, it's so good. Yeah, I love chai lattes, so I thought I would pick this one up. And then I also picked up some of these um, little salted caramel fudge cubes. How cute are these? Um, I thought these would be really cute to put them in like a glass jar in like a hot chocolate station. It's getting to that time of year where coffee stations turn into hot chocolate stations. I just kind of sprinkled these on and I just thought, oh, so cute. And these were, okay, these were quite expensive. These were 5 99 but um, you get 450 grams, so yeah. Also, it came like this, like it hasn't been opened and I haven't eaten any, so I don't know why we're missing any from here, but they all look like that. Of course, I did pick up some more candles. I got this um, Purity Lab Sweet Pumpkin Candle. I think this is the most beautiful little design. Look how cute it looks. Uh, this was $7.99. Smells amazing. It's very fresh actually. I wouldn't say it's the most autumnal scent, but it's fresh and I like it. And yeah, I love the little pictures, like I love the little illustrations on here. And then also got this large soup mug. This is like the best thing to take to work. So you can put your soup in here and then heat it up. Um, absolutely love it. I love the little design. I think it's very pretty, very like minimalistic. And this was only $3.99 and you've obviously got the lid on top too and yeah I just thought this was such a cute little thing I had to pick it up as soon as I saw it and I also found the most beautiful reed diffuser this is the vanilla brown sugar scent and it's basically just got all these little like winter autumn berries pine cones beautiful ribbon around it and yeah this just screams autumn to me it looks amazing I haven't smelt it but it looks like it's going to be lovely. Again, putting it on like a little side table or something. Very cute. I then picked up the Cinnamon Pumpkin GC Harvest little diffuser. It's just got a tiny little pumpkin there. And I just thought, how can you walk past this and not pick it up? This was $4.99 and it's a really big diffuser actually. So you get loads of product in here. I've also just realised I've still got chewing gum in my mouth and that just feels so wrong to be chewing chewing gum when you're filming a video. Three more bits from Home Sense. They are all candles, so I'm gonna go through it really fast. Um, I got the Sand and Fog Apple Picking Soy Candle. I love the lid, just think that's so pretty. 
Oh my god, I've really snapped my acrylic. But yeah, it's a double wicked candle. It smells absolutely amazing. It's like the freshest, like, harvest apple type scent. This I absolutely love because this is just a bit of me. It's the Dark Oud Scented Candle by Mystic Oracle. Look at the label. I say it's Mystic Oracle. It's by DW Home. They do the best autumn candles, hands down. It's got the little spider on there. And, yeah, this smells beautiful. I then also picked this little guy up. How cute is this? This was $7.99 and I won't be burning this even though it is a candle. It's just going to be a cute little decoration but it looks so lifelike. It's amazing. Wait, I've got one more Home Sense candle. It is the DW Home White Pumpkin um, Oatmeal and Creamy Vanilla Bean with a Bourbon Infused Brown Sugar Pumpkin. So we've just got this wooden lid and how gorgeous is this? It's just displayed so beautifully. So... There's those. Okay, moving on to some bits from Next. First thing I picked up was this a cute little um, coaster holder. So it's a little hedgehog. It looks like it's carved out of wood. How cute is this? And it's just got four little coasters which are shaped like acorns. I just thought this was so pretty. This was... I can't see the price. Um, I do a lot of my shopping online at Next. Um, Although we do have a really amazing next home near us. I just feel like I do all my like online shopping late at night when I should be asleep or doing something more productive. Um, but yeah, I saw this and I was like, I have to get this. This is so cute. I then picked up this little silver pumpkin shaped dish. As you can see, this one was £12. It's just this beautiful like metallic silver colour. Now, again, I would just use this as a decorative piece. You could definitely put some things in here. You could put like that... Um, like dried cinnamon sticks and orange and stuff like that if you wanted to do the absolute most already. I feel like it's maybe a tiny bit too early, but yeah, I love this. That was so pretty. I then got this set of four glass bowls and they're all shaped as apples and this was 20 pounds. I'm gonna try and open it and just show you guys one. Um, you, they look, how perfect is this for like an autumn night in? You can put like your sweets in here, your popcorn, or you can put like, again, some nice decoration or something. I just thought these were so cute. They're like perfect little dessert bowls as well. Um, I then picked up two of these little white pumpkin tea light holders. How sweet are these? I love them. Um, so they were £8 each and I just think they are so cute. I love that they're white and they're not too like kind of in your face and they could just kind of blend in with the rest of your decor. And yeah, I just thought these were so sweet. It was one of those things I was like, I have to have those immediately. Then picked up this little acorn shaped chopping bowl. This is chopping bowl <laughs> chopping board this was 20 pounds and i love it it looks like so like rustic and beautiful and i just love it so much and yeah this one was from next two so i have really kindly been gifted two products from a lovely brand and i don't know about you guys but in the autumn as soon as it kind of starts getting darker or just colder i want to stay in and i tend to do a lot more self-care so i thought this would fit perfectly in this video i'm going to leave all the information and links and stuff down below but the brand in question is k facial they really kindly sent me some bits i'm going to show you them very quickly with a little demonstration inserted of how to use them and yeah i thought i'd share them because i think you guys will genuinely really like these products too and they're such a game changer so Let's have a look. First thing I was sent was the Sonic Facial Sculptor. So either in a second or right now, you should probably see a clip of me using this. So it comes with this gorgeous little leather, leather? It comes with this gorgeous velvet bag. And inside, a very interesting looking um, facial sculptor. This feels so good when you do it. I like to do it in the morning and in the evening. It's great for all skin types. You guys probably know I do get quite dry, if not sensitive skin. And none of these products irritate the skin. This is also really great because your face, even in your face, your muscles can hold tension. So this kind of gets rid of any tension you've got on your face, really relaxes the muscles. And obviously, as you would see, kind of gives that nice sculpt sculpted effect. I probably should have done it before this video because double chins are looking cute, but it really kind of makes your face look a lot more lifted and sculpted. This is the big daddy doll. So they sent me 
the Aqua Facial. So again, I'm going to insert a clip of how you actually use this one. And we've got the little box with all of the attachments too. This is brilliant if you do suffer with like acne or spots or whatever because this genuinely helps to really clear your face and get rid of any kind of like dirt and impurities and things. And yeah, this is brilliant if you have been out the night before. So I look absolutely horrendous right now. It's boiling hot, got straight home from work, took my makeup off. As you can see, had a bit of an allergic reaction to something, hence the spots. Um, so I have just sat and played with this for a little while, and of course I'm going to show you guys too. But this is the Aqua Facial, the steamer by K Facial. And two little chambers, and I've basically just put filtered water in here. They suggest that you use some kind of like filtered water instead of just plain tap water, but I guess it depends what the water pressure and stuff is like where you live. As you can see here, I have done half of my face already and the water is all murky. I don't know how well you can see that actually, um, but it's looking gross and that's literally within two minutes of doing this. Um, you also get different suction heads. So I've just gone for one of the smaller ones just as I'm playing around with it today. And um, you have three different motions. So when you press this little button here, you will have green, blue, and I think it's red. And I like to go for the blue setting. It's the medium setting, and I just feel like that works really well for my skin. Okay, so as you can see, the water is getting even more dirty. This is basically just drawing all of the rubbish and impurities and stuff out of my skin. The more you use this, the more your skin will benefit from this. Obviously, this is my first use. So when I actually... I think probably doing this twice a week would be really helpful. Um, it should help clear your skin, which as you can see, <laughs> I need a little bit of help with that right now. Um, it does look, when I'm doing it, it might look like it's really pulling my skin and like it's painful. It's not, it's just like a little suction cup. It does leave a little bit of redness for a few minutes, but it's completely fine. It's pain-free, it doesn't hurt, and it's really quick and easy to use. And my face feels really like refreshed, like I've just had like an aqua facial, which is obviously what this is just at home. And being able to see all of the impurities and dirt that it's taken out of your skin is very satisfying. So this is the facial sculpture. It's got these two sculpting balls here. You could actually put this in the fridge if you wanted it to be really like cooling and refreshing, which I kind of wish that I did today, but I didn't. At the, butter, at the bottom, you've also got an on and off switch too. And obviously when you press it on, it just kind of helps it roll a lot smoother. So basically what you're supposed to do is drag it up like this. underneath your eyes and everything and again the more you use this the more benefits you will see so you're not going to see instant results the first time you use this but again if you do this a couple of times a week you should kind of see more sculpted results within your face which personally I need because a little double chin coming through um but I love this this feels so relaxing it's literally like someone's giving you a facial it's amazing and really convenient this is this perfect little tool that you can carry with you wherever you go so if you're going on holiday or traveling somewhere you can easily bring this with you and do like a little five ten minute facial in your hotel room or something there are several different ways that you can use this one so you can apply like your favorite cleansers or serums and stuff after this and obviously it will give you a really nice glowy effect and a really nice smooth glide um or you can do it on dry skin it does recommend for sensitive skin like i have that you could either do it on just your dry skin after using the aqua um, facial because obviously my face is a little bit damp and feels really nice and kind of refreshed or again you can put some serum on so i have just done it um just after using the aqua facial and i didn't put any extra serum on and this feels really lovely but i think i might try it with a little bit of serum and see which one i prefer so personally i do actually prefer this on dry skin um with the serum it's still lovely but i just feel like it kind of moves the product around a little bit so i definitely prefer to do this just kind of on dry skin or freshly um like facial cleansed skin but uh, yeah, this tool is so nice. It kind of stimulates the whole face. It gets the blood moving in the right direction, helps with blood circulation, which I believe should help with eliminating acne. If you've got more blood circulation and stuff kind of flowing through, um, it should help with blemishes and stuff. So again, <laughs> I'm going to keep doing this and hopefully it will help reduce some of the redness and some of the spots that have all of a sudden appeared on my face. Love these two products so far. I will keep I will keep you guys updated on my Instagram and leave links to these down below. But um yeah so far 
really really impressed with these and i will definitely keep you guys updated in here we have got these beautiful gold and bronze little pumpkins and yes you guessed it i don't want to fall out these are little candles so oh, they smell amazing i mean these smell like christmas i wouldn't say they smell like autumn these literally smell like christmas so festive but that's fine because autumn is basically christmas am i right <laughs> Also from Anthropology, I picked up this mug. I feel like you may have seen quite a few people with this as well. This was £12, which I know £12 for a mug is a bit like, mm, but for Anthropology, I think that's a really good price. And I love it. It's actually quite big as well. So definitely going to have a hot chocolate in here with my pumpkin syrup. Um, but yeah, this is just so beautiful. And again, I love the colour. I love that it's not all like traditional, like bright orange in your face. I do love the autumnal colours, but something a little bit more subtle is just nice sometimes. And this kind of fits in with my decor a little bit more. And I also picked up some tea towels from Anthropology, which I know sounds really interesting. But again, they are obviously autumn themed. It says, you're the pumpkin to my spice at the bottom. Well, you can see that, but I just love that because I've already had four pumpkin spice lattes, um, not in a day, but since they came out on the 2nd of September, and I believe today is the 4th, so, oops. Then have this gorgeous little wreath, this is perfect for kind of putting on your front door, or you could even put it like inside the house, absolutely love all the colours, and yeah, this was actually made by one of my mum's friends, I'll leave her business, um, like the link to her Facebook page if you'd like to buy one, or even just go and have a look. Um, if you are local to the kind of like Basingstoke area because I think it's only like local um, delivery and pick up and stuff but if you do live in that area um, feel free to check them out I will leave the link down below then from B&M do not worry guys I have a huge uh, home bargains and B&M haul coming up soon but I had to share these with you um, I picked up these little acorn decorations they're three pounds each they're in this kind of like lightly bronzed color kind of a mixture of silver and gold i just think these look so pretty again perfect little decoration you could put on your fireplace on like a little side table or something and they're just very subtle and i really like them so yeah i've got two of those i obviously picked up the autumn candle from the white company this has got pear quince and apricot in it and it honestly smells insane i feel like you need an autumn candle for every I feel like you need a white company candle for every season. I love the winter one as well. That is incredible. I actually think I've already got one of those um, in storage because I think I got two last year. Um, but yeah, this smells insane. So if you haven't ever tried this, please try and get a tester of it or pick it up in like a homeware shop near you, like a department store or something because so worth the money it's amazing so guys thank you so much for watching today's video i really hope you enjoyed it if you did please don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and subscribe down below and yeah i promise i'm not going to be taking a two month break again thank you so much if you have stuck with me and yeah i will see you in my next one